What's going on guys? Today I got a video of my entire Blu-ray collection, so uh, I'm going to try to go through this video pretty quickly. Um, you know, there's a lot of Blu-ray, so I'm just going to name them. I'm going to try not to talk about them. Um, just show you guys my collection, and uh, yeah, let's get to it. Try to make this quick. So, this aren't, this isn't in any order, I just took them out randomly, so, uh, you know, you're going to see some movies that are sequels, and they're not going to be in order, but here we go. So, first up, Anchorman 2, Step Brothers, House of a Thousand Corpse, great classic horror movie, I love that movie, Rise of the Empire, the 300, sequel to it, pretty good movie. Jackass 3 Unrated, gotta love these movies. Who wouldn't? Fast and Furious, this is a Universal 100th Anniversary Edition. Um, I love the Fast and Furious movies, as you guys know. So I try to collect every single version of Blu-ray, so here's one of them. Pretty cool. I got CM Punk Best in the World, huge WWE fan. CM Punk was an awesome wrestler, so, uh, you know, CM Punk, of course. I got the Raw 100 Top 100 Moments, so I got a couple of WWE Blu-rays, so this is a good one. Final Destination 5, Halloween 2, which I uh, got over there, the whole Halloween set, but uh, here's another one of them. Love the Halloween movies. Marvel's Avengers, good movies. Hobbit, The Unexpected Journey, a uh, digibook version, which comes with a whole bunch of, uh, you know, pages of stuff. The Hurt Locker, pretty good war movie. The Last Exorcism Part 2, great series. First one was the best, but this one was really good too. Lord of the Rings, uh, The Two Towers, great series. Lord of the Rings, The Fellowship of the Ring, awesome movie. Tom Hanks Castaway, classic, 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 awesome movie. Alright, so let's get to the next pile. Got a Randy Orton, The Evolution of a Predator. Randy Orton's an awesome wrestler. WrestleMania 28, Rock vs. John Cena, really cool. This is a good WrestleMania. Prometheus, amazing movie. WWE Falls Count Anywhere, pretty, you know, pretty good. I wish they had more stuff in here. Paranormal Activity, the first one, which is actually the really only good one. The rest of them freaking sucked. The Others, Nightmare on Elm Street, classic horror movie. Who can't love that? Mama, uh, mediocre movie in my opinion. Zombieland, awesome comedy. I love this movie. Ted, another amazing movie. I love Ted. Probably one of the best comedies, in my opinion. Um, and I got this Tornado Chasers, for those of you who know. Uh, so Reed Timmer, who's a Tornado Chaser, got it signed by the whole uh, uh, team. So that's really cool. Really cool Blu-ray. Alright, next up, Fast and Furious 6 Steelbook. Love Fast and Furious movies. The Woman in Black 2, horrible movie. The Marine 4, they're crappy movies, but they're fun to watch. Fast 5. Probably the best one out of all of them, I think. Death at a Funeral, really good funny movie. Uh, Spider-Man 1, um, I like the Spider-Man movies. A lot of people like the uh, Amazing Spider-Man series better, but I like these ones better. Tobey Maguire did an amazing job. Uh, here's the other Lord of the Rings, the third one, probably the best one. Just long movies. Uh, Spider-Man 2, which was... Uh, pretty good. I think the first one's still the best. This one's pretty good. WrestleMania 27, probably the worst WrestleMania in recent history. Uh, the whole Chucky collection, I love the Chucky movies, so, uh, you know, gotta have this. Chucky's the best. Uh, the Polar Express, great Christmas movie. Gotta love those. Uh, let's see, World Trade Center, pretty good movie. Um, you know... Good, you know, there's better 9-11 movies out there, but this one's pretty good. I like it. Uh, here's my WrestleMania 29 Blu-ray signed by Brad Maddox, who's uh, pretty much a no-name now. Um, but it was cool to meet him. He was a nice guy, so I got him to sign this, so that was pretty cool. And then I got the Royal Rumble 2012, you know, just collect some WWE Blu-rays. They're nothing special. Uh, Delivers from Evil, 
really bad horror movie. Melissa McCarthy's Tammy. She's a good actress. She's funny. So, you know, this movie's not the best, but there's a few laughs in there. Uh, DX, One Last Stand. Or One... One, one, yeah, One Last Stand, sorry. Ah, uh, this is good. Awesome faction. Or stable, whatever the hell you want to call it. Um, WWE's Oh My God Top 50 Moments. Really good Blu-ray. Lots of cool stuff in there. 300, the first one. Amazing. Tom Hanks' Captain Phillips. Amazing movie. Behind Enemy Lines, the first one. The only really good one, which is awesome. Uh, Breaking Bad, the complete second season, an amazing TV show. I miss this show. I wish they would make more. All right, next pile. A Christmas Story. A Tom and Jerry, you know, gotta live the childhood memories. Home Alone 1 and 2, the probably one of the best Christmas movies out there. Uh, speaking of best Christmas movies out there, Christmas Vacation, another one of them. Into the Storm, pretty good movie, you know, it's a guilty pleasure movie. Um, Son of God, a digibook. Pretty good, you know, story about God and Jesus, the Bible, pretty much. Um, Sinister 1, still gotta get Sinister 2, but uh, Sinister, really creepy movie. Uh, Black Swan, amazing, amazing, amazing movie. I freaking love this movie. Classic, classic. Uh, Ouija, uh, mediocre horror movie. A Haunted House, yeah, it's an alright movie, few laughs. Um... Here we go. The Amazing Spider-Man 2, which is my, yeah, I can't say my favorite one out of the Amazing Spider-Man series. I can't decide, but this one's really good. I love it. Uh, Family Guy, Star Wars, you know. I got this at Blockbuster, I think, so this is really old. Uh, love it, though. Cloudy with a Chance of Meatballs. Uh, Breaking Bad, a complete first season. I gotta get the rest of the seasons. Um, let's see. Oculus. Pretty good horror movie. Hangover Part 2. Uh, this one's alright. Hangover Part 1, or the first Hangover, is still the best one. Too Fast, Too Furious. I love it. Don't care what other people say. It's a good one. The Strangers. I got this at Blockbuster. Really old. Uh, really good creepy horror movie. Scary Movie 3. The first three scary movies are the only good ones out there, so uh, this one's amazing. The Lego Movie. Heaven is for real. Rio 2, pretty good kids movie. I don't like to label them as kids movies because, you know, anyone can watch them. Uh, Liam Neeson nonstop, he's an amazing actor. I love his movies. A Haunted House 2, this one was just trash. Ted 2, love the Ted movies. This one was pretty good. I liked it. Usually sequels suck, but this one was really good. The Martian, amazing movie. Matt Damon did an amazing job in this. Love that movie. Insidious Chapter 3. All the Insidious movies were good, but uh, I think the first one's still scariest. Uh, Stone Cold Blu-ray. The Ring, Steel Book. Uh, the Ring is one of my favorite movies of all time. It's freaking suspenseful. It's scary. I freaking love it. So, uh, The Ring. Wrong Turn 2. Wrong Turn movies are just so fun to watch. Yeah, they're not that good, but they're freaking awesome. I love them. They're so gory, and they're just, you know, that classic gore horror movie. Uh, not scary at all, just your plain old gory anything, you know, everything besides scary for a horror movie. Really good. Lone Survivor, really good movie. Wrong Turn 1, which is amazing. First one was the best. The Exorcist, a digibook version. Exorcist is a classic horror movie. The Hunger Games Catching Fire Steelbook. Love the Hunger Games movies. Uh, the original Hunger Games, the first one, Steelbook. Paul, pretty good comedy. Little Fockers, it's alright. Shaun of the Dead Steelbook, really good comedy, I like it. And Fast and Furious Steelbook, I have a lot of these, so uh, another one. The Conjuring sequel, Annabelle, pretty creepy. A Halloween 35th Anniversary Edition digibook, um, amazing. Love the Halloween movies. Paranormal Activity 2, actually, you know, this one was pretty good too, I liked it. Paranormal Activity, the marked ones, kind of sucked. 127 Hours, really good movie. 
The Walking Dead, the complete first season. Gotta love The Walking Dead. Scary Movie 1, the best one out of all of them. The classic good one. Texas Chainsaw Massacre, 45th, 40th Anniversary Edition. These are really good horror movies. I like them. 28 Days Later, good old zombie movie. Contagion, really, you know, pretty good movie. Kind of creepy, if you think about it. The Avengers Age of Ultron, awesome movie. Everest, really good movie. I like the story on this and how it's based on a true story. Got another Christmas movie, Elf, probably another one of my favorites. Will Ferrell's hilarious in that. Uh, Poltergeist, the original, which is amazing. Get Hard, another Will Ferrell movie. This is actually really funny. Will Ferrell and Kevin Hart have to do more movies together. WWE's The Attitude Era. The uh, WWE, the greatest superstars of the 21st century. Uh, the Fast and Furious Tokyo Drift Steelbook. Uh, the least of my favorites out of the series, but still fun. Uh, Too Fast, Too Furious Steelbook. Love them. The original, The Fast and the Furious Steelbook. Uh, I don't know where the other ones are. I thought they were all together. Uh, Jurassic World, really good movie. I love this. Uh, a really kind of a no-name movie, Air, Norman Reedus from The Walking Dead. Pretty good. Uh, Jingle All the Way with Arnold Schwarzenegger. Gotta love this movie. Really good Christmas movie. Uh, <laughs> Arnold Schwarzenegger's hilarious in it. Marvel's Ant-Man. Paul Walker, my favorite actor of all time, so I'm trying to get all his movies. Uh, this one's Running Scared. I got uh, another Ring Blu-ray. This is with a Best Buy exclusive lenticular slipcover. Uh, the Night Before. Uh, you know, it was kind of a disappointment. Uh, I thought it would be funnier, but Seth Rogen's hilarious nonetheless. Daddy's Home. Will Ferrell, Mark Wahlberg. Hilarious movie. The Hunger Games Mockingjay Part 2, an epic, epic finale to the series. Star Wars The Force Awakens, love this movie. I love Star Wars. Uh, the seventh one is easily my favorite now out of all of them, though. Sorry for the people who still like the, not, the uh, originals of uh, 4, 5, and 6. I love them, too, but, you know, seven's my favorite. Uh, 12 Rounds 3 with Dean Ambrose. Chappie. The Spongebob movie, Sponge Out of Water. Paul Blart, Mall Cop 2. Another Paul Walker movie. This one's actually really good. I love it. Brick Mansions. Pride, Prejudice, and Zombies. Uh, you know, I have mixed feelings about this, but overall I liked it. Tombstone, classic good movie. Ride Along 2, another Kevin Hart and Ice Cube. Really good movie. Twister, good classic movie. I used to watch this a lot when I was a kid. Disney's Cinderella. The Walking Dead Complete First Season, Lenticular. Grown Ups 2, love Adam Sandler. James Cameron's Avatar, gotta have that movie. Texas Chainsaw, another one. This one I believe is a remake. I have so many of them, it's hard to keep up with them. Uh, Scream five film, five film series, probably my favorite horror movies of all time is the Scream movie, so Scream right there. Uh, Kane and See No Evil 2, an okay movie. The Scream 1, the best one. WWE's Countdown, you, you know, they're okay to watch. The Walking Dead Complete 5th Season Lenticular. Scream 2. Dragon Ball Z Resurrection F. Love Dragon Ball Z, so trying to get all the Dragon Ball Z stuff. Christmas Vacation Steelbook. Awesome Christmas movie. Deadpool. Really good movie. Love it. Classic. Pixels. Uh, a lot of people didn't like this movie. Uh, I enjoyed it a little bit. Sure, most of it was pretty bad, but, you know, it was alright. I liked it. I enjoyed it. Vacation, another one a lot of people didn't really like. Um, I liked it. It was hilarious. Um, Poltergeist, the remake. This movie's just horrible. I'm not even going to talk about that. That was an awful movie. The Interview, James Franco, Seth Rogen. Really funny movie. Liam Neeson's Taken 2. 
I love Liam Neeson. He's a good actor. Taken series are amazing. Uh, I like them all. The Forest, really good, suspenseful, creepy movie in my opinion. Titanic, classic movie. I used to watch this a lot too when I was a kid. I love Titanic. WWE 50 Years of Sports Entertainment. WrestleMania 30, this was awesome. I uh, went to there in person, so it's really cool to watch this on Blu-ray. Red Dawn, the remake, I actually really enjoyed this more than the original one. Saving Private Ryan, classic horror, uh, not horror movie, sorry. Uh, war movie. Leonardo DiCaprio, Shutter Island, he's a really good actor, I love him. Uh, this is a really good suspenseful movie. The Crazies, you know, it's alright. I enjoyed it. Um, here's my Star Wars steelbooks. So we'll start with the first one. Star Wars Episode 1. Horrible movie, but still good. Episode 2, steelbook. Pretty good. I enjoyed it. Episode 3, I loved it. I don't know why people didn't like it. I liked it. It was really good. Episode 4, here's the classic ones, though, which are amazing. I love them. So four, Steelbook. Here's number five, Steelbook. Number six, Steelbook. And number seven's Steelbook. And then I got the Marvels, Avengers, Age of Ultron, Steelbook. I got the Hunger Games Mocking J Part 2 Steelbook. The Hunger Games Mocking J Part 1 Steelbook. Love the Hunger Games. The Visit, really good movie. Dark comedy and horror mixed into one, pretty good. Pixels Steelbook. Zombieland Steelbook, had to get it, love it. Randy Orton's The Condemned 2, you know, not good movies, but they're still fun to watch. Spider-Man 3, the worst one out of all of them, but I still enjoyed it. Wrong Turn 4, love the Wrong Turn movies, guys gotta check them out. Devil's Do, horrible movie. Wrong Turn 5, Bloodlines, love the Wrong Turn movies. The Conjuring, amazing, amazing movie. Great horror movie, it's got everything you want in a horror movie. Creepy, some jump scares, you know, not over the top. Dragon Ball Z Season 2, love Dragon Ball Z, so I'm getting them all on Blu-ray. Season 3 of Dragon Ball Z, Season 4, and season one. The Hateful Eight, I freaking love this movie. It's a movie you can watch a lot of times and never get tired of it. Another good classic Christmas movie that I love to watch, Deck the Halls, really funny. The Fast and the Furious Tokyo Drift. Furious Seven, the Walmart edition, love the cover of this. Paul Walker's my favorite actor, so love this movie. Fury 7's regular Blu-ray slipcover. Fury 7 uh, Steelbook, right there. And I actually have Fast 5, but it's not in my collection right now. So uh, here's the last two Fast and Furious Steelbooks, which is 6. And Fast and Furious 4, where they rebooted the franchise. Got Grown Ups 1. Wrong Turn 6, love this movie. Love all the wrong turns, they're just fun. Uh, Neighbors, I love Neighbors. This is a really good, funny movie. Seth Rogen is just amazing. American Sniper, really good movie. American Sniper Steelbook. WrestleMania 31, really good. Fast and Furious, you know, 4, the reboot. Scream 3, I loved it. A lot of people didn't. Scream 4, again, I loved it. A lot of people didn't. I love all the Scream movies. They're my favorite. Silent Hill Revelations. Pretty good movie. It's alright. Apollo 18, this movie sucked. Liam Neeson, A Walk Among the Tombstones. A really, really good movie. I really enjoyed this movie. Liam Neeson always puts a lot of effort into his movies. Wrong Turn 3, 
They're all pretty much the same. Cannibal eating people. They're still fun to watch. Chernobyl Diaries. This was, um, it was alright. That's all I gotta say about it. Child's Play. The original of Chucky. Love it. Fast and Furious 1, the original. I got so many Fast and Furious movies of everything because they're my one of my favorite movies of all time. So, Fast Five is somewhere. I'm not sure where it is, but I have a steelbook of Fast Five too. But here's one. Uh, Need for Speed. This is, uh, you know, not a, the best movie. Probably not a good movie, but I love it. It's probably a good guilty pleasure with uh, Aaron Paul. I enjoyed it. It's a movie I can watch a lot of times. So, I loved it. The Woman in Black. It was uh, the first one. It's good. The second one just sucks. The Amazing Spider-Man, the first one. You know, I love the Amazing Spider-Man series. Spider-Man in general. Who doesn't love Spider-Man? Uh, Lucy. This was a surprisingly awesome movie. I freaking loved it. Wish it was longer, though. The Hobbit, the Battle of Five Armies. Hobbit series were amazing. Liam Neeson's Taken 3. And last but not least, well, I got some up there, but The Cabin in the Woods. Uh, you know, I was going into this thinking it was a horror movie, so <laughs> I was almost kind of disappointed, but it's a good movie. And then up on my shelf, I have the Halloween uh, box set of all the Halloween movies, and then I got another Fast and Furious collection. So, you know, I got a lot of Blu-rays, but there's still a lot more I want. Um, there's like hundreds more I probably plan on to buy, you know, just, uh, there's too many to buy at one time, so I will be buying a lot more, hopefully my next Blu-ray collection will be double the size, I'm hoping, but, uh, yeah, if you guys enjoyed the video, comment, like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.